Peekaboo! Hello everybody, it's Paul's Ranger. Today I'm doing my top 10 favorite animatronics. Now these are purely my favorite, but if you have your own favorite top 10, please leave a comment down below in the description. Now I am going to refer both toy and actual animatronics for some characters. So with that said, let's get on a roll and not look at this guy's face and die. I think that's what we should recommend. Further ado, let's go to number 10, and it's blatantly obvious, BB, who everybody hates him so much, or as we know him as, Fuckboy. Well, it's blatantly obvious that is what we name him as, and he's a pain in absolute ass to deal with, and need to shove him in that vent, and keep him there. With that said, I hate him. So number 9, it's Toy Bonnie, who, to be my opinion, except for that one there looks good looking, but the actual Toy Bonnie... It kind of reminds me of Goofy, with their goofy face, but yet again though the model is good, so good with Scott, but I prefer the original Bonnie. I hate that rabbit. So at number 8 is Toy Freddy, who looks fatter than Jabba the Hutt. As many others say, that I think Toy Freddy's fatter than Freddy, and looks more creepy and has sausage fingers rather than finger fingers. But I feel sorry for Freddy, as he's going to kick his fat backside. So, at number 7, it's Mangor, the creepy, whatever the hell it is, female or male animatronic. I don't like this one. You want to prefer? This one. At least it's cute and it looks huggable. And it looks normal. Except for that thing right there. Ugh. So, at number 6, it's Toy Chica, who people have a crush on. I think I need to cave some skulls in to make sure that no, that's a scary animatronic. Unless if it was anime 5, like this, what you're looking right now. Press the like button if you'll date that chicken. Speaking of a chicken, I'm hungry. So, at number 5 is Chica, the original Chica the chicken. Not a duck, a chicken who I feel like shoving pizza or a jam sandwich in its face and say, eat it, chicken. Or descend it with the other chickens. Us, but Chica at at number five. So at number four is Bonnie and Withered Bonnie. Poor rabbit. It never saw the light of day. What happened to its face? But any case, run for your lives! It's Scary Bonnie, and he's always at the first at your door to kick your arse. So with that said, so at number three is Foxy the Pirate, which everyone loves, and there's Mangle saying hi, and Foxy's like, I don't give a damn one. But Foxy is Foxy, and he runs down your hall and bites your face off, unless if it's Mangle in anime form, um, I don't know what she's doing, and Foxy's embarrassed. Oh dear, no good. So, at number two, it's Freddy and Golden Freddy, and... The reason I put them together is, to me, they're kind of the same, except for they have different histories, they're different characters, as Golden Freddy is Fredbear, and Freddy's just Freddy, or Are You Ready For Freddy? That never gets old. But with really that said, though, I like both of them as they're interesting. So what's that? who's at number one? Springtrap! And obviously Purple Man, because they are the same. It's Purple Man shoved in the suit, he was making. So, I like Purple Man as he's a very interesting main character of the story and same for Springtrap as they were both hinted in the first game and they were revealed in the second one and now they're just straight out revealed in the third one. Which I'm looking forward to the fourth one if we're going to get more of Springtrap and Purple Guy as they were the main characters and the main focus for the story for Five Nights at Freddy's. But with that said, did you like my top 10 favorites? Put a comment down below. And my brand new mic. Avina Zane.